Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Super Meat Boy Forever. Last time we left off, we did the first two levels of Ox Dead Beef. And I guess we're gonna go ahead into the third level now. Uh, sure, Meat Ninja. Uh... Okay, well this is immediately starting off weird. Oh, okay, I thought we were gonna have to juggle that metal dude. Wait, we... Probably are, aren't we? Oh, okay, that was all I had to do there. Never mind. No, we don't have to juggle that uh, metal armadillo boy. Huh. How do I get enough height to actually get up there? I've made pretty decent progress in this level so far, I like to think. Uh, Alright. Ow. Okay. Kick. Punch. Whatever. Oh, we did it, but... Hmm. What do we do once we get past that part? It's honestly really hard just to make that jump at the beginning. I've had my coffee today, and I'm just kind of I'm just kind of chilling right now. So uh, maybe maybe we won't see any salt today. Uh, wait, what was that? What did I do there? What did I do there that allowed me to go up like that? <laughs> I'm not I, I like am not aware of what I just did that that did that. I like. I don't know. I wasn't... I didn't catch it. <laughs> I was just pressing... I was just pressing the buttons I would normally press, but I, like, went up a lot for some reason? And I don't know why. Is... Am I just... Did I just not notice something? Or some, like, weird thing happened? Like a glitch or something? Or is this some, like, other new tech, like in Celeste? I'm always gonna think that now when I play a precision platformer like this. After Celeste had, like, at the end, at, like, basically in the post-game, they're like, Oh yeah, by the way, all these things exist that could have made the entire game easier. All you had to do was realize they exist. And then they give you tutorials on them. And it's like, oh. Oh no. Hmm. Okay, let's try... Getting a bit higher up here before we make the jump. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, I nailed that, and then I screwed it up. Yep. I nailed it, and then I screwed it up. Yeah, okay, so definitely what we gotta do... Uh, I just... I just did... Out of habit, I did the same thing I did last time again. Okay, so this, this, then this, then that, then that. Boom. Nice fly, jump over here. Grab the key. Shit. Yeah, these levels are pretty difficult, but, uh... Like I said, they're not boss fights, which I like. Is uh, the boss fights are usually awful. Ah, shit. Okay, well, out of here. Wait, I wonder if I'm supposed to do that. I didn't, I didn't think about that as an option, but then I could kick the, like, little, uh, this thing. I, I could kick it over there, right? If this is gone. Wouldn't that work? Huh. That might be something. I'm not positive, mind you, but that might be something. Shit. In fact, I think that is actually what I have to do. Okay. So let's try to do that. Let's give it a shot. Boom. And boom. And there we go. Boom. Ah, but I die. Hmm. Hmm. But I die. What do we do about this particular predicament? That I don't know. Fall down. Ah. Damn it. Stupid yield signs. Squares. Yield sign. Squares. Boom. Boom. Okay. Key. Jump over here. Jump down there. Jump here. Hit that. Punch that. And yeah! Okay, that, that was what I was supposed to do. Yay. Uh, okay, I think I screwed up there. Yeah, I, I think I screwed that up. Punch. Uh, yeah, I think I'm supposed to jump off of it, not hit it twice. Which is easier said than done. Uh. Hmm. Yeah, I think hitting it twice is a death sentence, but it's kind of hard for me to not... Hit it twice. Like, there is per- okay, see, I caught it there, but... 
Ah, see. Okay, so yeah, that's what you're supposed to do. Hmm. But I... Hmm. I don't, I don't know how to get up once I get here. Okay, maybe that's not what I'm supposed to do. I don't think it's go back there with that guy. Right? Like, I don't, I don't think that's the solution. It really feels like this would be the solution. I just don't know how to jump that high. Hmm. Wow. Okay, this one's actually stumped me immediately. Like, I don't see what I'm supposed to do here. Huh. I feel like that's not the solution, though, what I'm trying. So let's go here. It feels like I gotta do something with you, because, like, otherwise, why do you exist over there? Right? Like, why is he here if I don't do something with him? Hmm. Yeah, just very, very stumped by this one. Huh. Hmm. Okay, well, I... I'm... I don't think I'm gonna make any progress just kind of sitting here butting my head against this. Any meaningful progress that I should really show, so... I'm just gonna cut until, uh, when I figure out what the hell I'm supposed to be doing here. <laughs> Oh, that would help. Okay, that was what I was putting. So that's why the fly is there. Yeah, I get over there and then I knock it back the other way. Okay. Okay, that's actually a little hard to implement. Yeah, that required some, uh... different thinking than my brain was currently doing. There we go. Now we're up here. Hit that. Ah, uh, what? I pressed it. Ah, uh, I think I pressed A too soon there. Like, before I actually connected with the wall. So, instead, Meat Boy just slid down the wall slowly and died. Uh, what am I doing? I don't need to jump there. I just need to slide down, do that. Ah! Alright, jump, jump, and jump, and... There! Ah! Damn it. Too soon. Too soon. Ah! Fuck! That little guy is, uh, particularly annoying. There. The eye. Uh, and now I've... Yeah, I can't get the height back to get up there. I'm just happy I figured out what I was supposed to do. More than anything. Ah, damn it. I couldn't get my dash punch off in time. Okay, and that time he was just in a bad spot. But at least I know what I'm supposed to do. Bang, bang, bang. There we go, bang. And bang. Oh god, what is... What is- what is happening up there now? Hmm. The main thing I notice about these levels that makes them, uh, more difficult is you get less checkpoints. A lot less checkpoints. Like I said, this is more like, I don't know, uh, Vanilla Meat Boy? Or Vanilla Meat Boy. Meat- Meat Boy- the first Meat Boy. Um, more than anything. Ah, shit. I was going the wrong direction. Maybe I- I think I have to go down there and use that thing that turns me around. Because I think otherwise I'm just gonna die. And dead. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. There we go. Got up here. So we need to use this, jump over that, fall down here. And then go here, punch that, and then yeah! Oh, I'm totally gonna die immediately, aren't I? No? No. Okay. No, we're not. Ow. Okay, now we are, though. Uh, huh. Okay, so we need a way to slow ourselves down at this part, and I'm guessing this is the best way to do it. Okay, well that works. Ah, oh, shit! I didn't- I didn't see those spikes down there. The barbed wire, like, blocks, I guess? Where's that block in Minecraft? The barbed wire block. Probably in a mod somewhere. Probably used to keep mobs out of your house or something. Ah, oh, shit. Well, that's not what I needed. There. Now we go up the reverse. Yeah, uh, I've realized that it seems like these levels may be like... Um... Dr. Fetus, like, testing out levels for Meat Boy to complete, or something like that, because we see him in the background on the computer, so maybe this is like a simulation of Meat Boy, 
Or it's all those, like, Meat Boy clones that we saw. Or something. Uh, that's what somebody in the comments mentioned, and I thought was a pretty good, uh, idea for what could potentially be happening there. Which, this reminds me of the levels in Crash Bandicoot, m uh, more specifically the recent one, with the, uh, flashback tapes. Where, um... It's basically tapes of Cortex testing Crash back at the beginning. Those were hard as hell, and that's why I didn't do all of them. But hey, I did a pretty fair amount of those, actually. I like to think. Alright. We just gotta go up this way now. Slow and Steady wins the race. No, it doesn't. It always loses. Slow and Steady sucks. Uh, Come on. We got this. Yeah, this, this particular part, I mean, these particular levels are pretty brutal, but, uh, I find that they're fun. Damn it. Hitting that block is, uh, a little hard sometimes, because, I, I don't know. I can't, I can't explain it right now, because I'm in the middle of playing, but it's hard to hit. Because you gotta, like, make sure you don't catch the ceiling, and also make sure you do a proper jump. I don't know, man. I'm bad at explaining things normally, much less when I'm trying not to die while playing a video game. There we go. Ah, fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> That's just rude. <laughs> I gotta give it to them, though. They got me. They got me good. They got me real good. I was like, whew, I, I can finally rest. I got past the difficult part, and they're like, ha, no. Shit, I didn't get up high enough. Yeah. I gotta, you know, I... I hate... Um, the, uh, sadism employed in the Meat Boy, but at the same time, I gotta respect them. Like, I gotta respect them for being willing to, to make something that puts people through this, you know? I gotta, I gotta respect them. They really stick to what they know and are really good at it. But as far as, um games go by, uh... I guess it's not really this developer, because I think Team Meat and, uh... Edmund are technically two different... Like, they're not together. I think they just, like, reference each other's games or something? Uh, I'm not quite sure on the relationship between Team Meat and Edmund McMillan. I just know a lot of Meat Boy things are in his games, and... Yeah. Um... But... I like Binding of Isaac more than Meat Boy. I always have. But Meat Boy's cool. And jump, and jump, and j dash, yeah, fuck you. Okay, oh god. I didn't ex- ah, oh, oops. Didn't expect to see that dude hanging out there. Okay, huh. ah, shit. Hmm. What do? Okay, there we go, I got you. Ah, shit, my head bonked on the ceiling. <laughs> head bonking, my worst enemy. Ah, shit. It's hard to get the timing down on punching that dude. Uh, because I feel like you gotta whoop, be pretty perfect on it. To hit him, and that time I was just at a bad cycle for him. I feel. Great, go. Thank you. Ah, shit. Okay, well, just yeet yourself into that, because we lost a lot of time there. Looks like I'm not going to be getting the A-plus on this level, everyone. I apologize. There we go. Oh, God, I tried to do the dive kick into the thing. It did not work. I panicked. Ow. I definitely panicked super hard. Okay, I expected him to run into the room there. After he slid off the ledge, but no. Okay, so... Bop, bop. I don't know why I didn't just slide kick. I'm used to doing the dash to hit it now, I guess. Okay, we can just circumvent you, sure. Ah, oh, damn it. If only I hadn't done the dive kick to hit it. So it, it does seem like we gotta do the dash punch there. To actually get in that room effectively. Go! And... Yeah, let's just circumvent you again. It's easier than killing you. There we go. Ah, and they put that last dude there to try and screw you. 
Okay. Uh, bang. 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 Right? Ah, uh, but I need to get the key from somewhere. Where's the key? Is it the key up here? Ah, the key is up there. Uh, and I yeeted myself into death. Uh, so yeah, we actually gotta hit this thing. I gained some time on the last, uh, screen. Hmm. Okay, so... Wing! Okay, I don't think I can use the boost pad to get up there, maybe? It seems like I should be able to, but... Either I'm not doing it right, or that's not what they intend. And, uh, I'm not quite sure yet. Well, that was a failure. There we go. And climb. Uh, that's not working. Let's try it from here. Ugh. So close. Okay, let's try that. Oh! Okay, never mind. That's a much easier way to do it. Okay, but I want to do it faster now that I actually know what to do. So, yeah. Boing. And, oh, shit. Okay, we did it. We're good. Okay, so... Oh, shit, I probably... Yeah, I want to... Okay. I think I want to hit the thingy again after I've opened up the... Yeah, because there's a... There's a hook there that we gotta ride. So I do have to hit the little change the level button, is what I am dubbing it. I have to hit that. Oh shit. Screwed up! So I gotta hit that again after I grab the key, because that swaps us back to this version. And yeah, ah oh shit, why did I do that? Uh, just eat yourself. We'd be losing time if I completed that version of the run. And if I can get A pluses, I would like to get them. Ah, shit, fuck. Go. Here we are. Okay. And boom. And boom, boom. Ah, okay, well, I missed you because you decided to fly up. Because you, you can't just stay stationary. You're like, no, I must move exactly five feet up and five feet down. That is my life. Yeah, there we go. Gotcha. Boom. And jump back over here. Fuck shit. Fuck you, smiley face block. <laughs> I hate you, smiley face block. Ah, oh, shit, what am I doing? Oh, God. My brain's falling apart. That's what I'm doing. Gosh. Ah, mm. Go. Mm. Yes. Uh, now, okay, my, my brain's just falling apart. Now is normally when I was playing the game, I would take a break. Like, I would go grab myself some water or something to help me out here. But, uh, wow, I did that without, uh, actually, uh, yeah. I'm sorry, I'm trying to focus right now because this is the furthest I've ever gotten. Okay, cool. Uh, that was when I would have, would, have, would have went and taken a break and grabbed something to drink and, you know, stretched a bit. But no. We don't- we don't have those, uh, luxuries here. We are doing an LP. I mean, I guess I could cut the video, but... Then- then I'd have to edit the cut part of that video, which I don't want to do. Oh, God! Hmm. Almost. That's a lot of flies, by the way. That's a lot of flies. Alright, up, and pop, and, ah, jump too soon. Oh, cool, yeah, see, I saved myself a lot of time. I'm at, uh, 4.3 again. So if we can do this part with, uh, out losing a lot of time, like I just did, uh, we should be able to get the A-plus on this mission, too. It's, I don't know why it seems like it's so easy for me to get the A-plus on this, on these missions. Maybe I just wasn't, like, as conscious of how the, like, timer worked before. Like, I wasn't really paying attention to it. Like, when I had a bad run of something, I didn't just die so I could redo it. Uh, but I don't know. Ah, shit. I think if I would have just rode the conveyor belt up there, I would have been fine. But I saw the enemy and I panicked. I was like, oh no, we gotta do something about that. But we didn't, I don't think. Ah, shit. Hmm. Yeah, these levels are definitely difficult, but, uh, not overly so yet. 
Like, I definitely think we will get there. Um, but I don't- I don't think we're super there yet. This- like, right now, these levels just remind me of Celeste levels, which aren't really too offensive. In fact, so far, I would say Celeste is straight up harder than this game. So, yeah. And smack, smack. Uh, oh, I wanted to ride that pipe back down, okay. My bad. Wasn't sure what I needed to do there. But yeah, so far I would say Celeste is definitely harder than this. And, yeah. Uh, I can also say... <laughs> I was gonna say I'll probably never play Celeste on the channel, but... I can't really say never, can I? It could happen sometime. If people want it. I probably wouldn't try... Uh, some of the Dark World. Dark World. Um, I forgot what they're called in that. What are they called in that? Some of the... Other... Oh, mixed, uh, B-sides. B-side levels. That's what I'm thinking of. Uh, there we go. That's what I wanted to get into, friends. Ah, but that just throws me into that. Uh, do I have to... Oh, I probably have to... Hit the, uh, transform the world button again. Yep, that's probably what I gotta do. Wow, we might only have one level in this episode. That's weird to think about, but but hey, I mean, whatever, I guess. These levels are getting tough, so this is gonna happen, where I can beat, like, one level an episode. So, this, uh, I definitely feel like this last part, Ox Dead Beef, is, uh, probably gonna take a bit. And, well... Come on, catch me, thank you. There we go. Okay, and we gotta... Fall down and hit you. Right? Oh, shit, that is correct. But I need to not kill myself next time. That is the key here. Don't kill yourself. Don't kill yourself, people. It's not good. You can probably just slide down that wall there. I wonder if that would save time or what. Not Honestly, not sure. Uh, bang, bang, bang. Oh no, that's the wrong way. Okay, well, I was supposed to jump there. Hmm. Yeah, everything's just happening so fast, it's, uh, hard for me to keep up sometimes. Like I said, you don't, you don't really get a break in this game, like, even in Souls game, a game where you can't pause, um, you get more of a break than this, because you can, like, kill all the enemies in the area, and your character stops moving, or you stop moving. And you can just kind of chill, and be like, okay, let's look at my items or whatever. But, uh, not here. This is like, no, always moving, always going. Unless you pause the game, but then you can't actually do anything with that, except take a break. So, it's like, eh. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, what the fu- Okay, I hit it, but then I ran into the things on the wall. Hmm. What a quandary we found ourselves in, yes. Uh, up. And bing. Alright, so at least I'm consistently doing this part. Now. Uh... Okay, well that wasn't what I was supposed to do. Aha! That is what I am supposed to do, everyone. Yeah. Okay, so I, I was switching it when I didn't need to switch it, basically. No! Don't you- don't you put- don't you put Nugget in the recycling bin and then put your- your, like, layer- I don't even know why you have your body in two layers. Why are you doing that? Wait, what? Uh... Okay, I got the- a plus on that, but why can I not, uh, go to these next levels? Huh. Do we need, like, a certain amount of pacifiers or something? I don't really know. Hmm. Hmm. And there's no Dark World- okay, no, never mind. There's no Dark World version of these levels. So maybe it's just I have to get an A plus on this? 
We got an A plus on these, and maybe that's why these are easier to get the A plus on because you actually need them to progress. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can grab an A plus in this really quick. And uh, yeah. Okay, we got the A plus. Yeah, there's the paint. Hey, I'm not dumb. You're dumb. Okay, so back to map. Okay, so if that happened, if I have an A plus on all of these now and we still haven't gotten the levels open here. I can only assume this means I need more pacifiers. So I'll probably look up uh, online before the next episode uh, what exactly we need to, how many pacifiers we need to unlock these possibly. So yeah, I guess we'll be taking care of that next time, but this is this is a fine length episode. I managed to get an A plus on all three of these, which is nice, but I do think it's quite a bit easier because uh, it seems like there's no dark world in this version. Like, so, and maybe you do need to A plus all of these before you can progress to this. I, I'm not sure, but uh, we'll find out. I'm, I don't know. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of Super Meat Boy Forever, and I will see you next time.